another motivational day. Um, I appreciate you getting on the call um, today. What I want to talk to you about is positioning and purpose. And some of the things that we go through, we, you know, we wonder about the position we're in. We question purpose at times. And um, what I want to talk to you about is looking at both of those. As far as the position you're in right now, um, I know it's uncomfortable um, because of everything that's going on. And, and, you know, a lot of times we wonder, well, what is my purpose? Am I, am I doing what I'm supposed to be doing with, with the issues that we're facing um, globally? Is this what we're supposed to be doing? And when I looked at both these words, I really thought about myself and the people that I'm around and, um, you know, business-wise. When it comes to positioning, what if, and, and just think about this, what if the situation that we're facing right now is actually putting us in the right position? And what do I mean by that? Considering everything that's going wrong and everything that's going on right now, um, what, if, what if this was the right position? And um, the other thing that I really thought about is the limitations that we're facing. So what are some of those limitations that people are facing right now? And um, I began to really think about a long time ago, the position and the limitations that people were in when things were going wrong actually put them in a better position and it helped them find their purpose. And I know that sounds like kind of odd to be able to do that, but what I'm getting at is that what if right now your limitations or the position you're in, putting you in a position where you have limitations, what if that is actually the best position for you to be in? And um, I, I just try and wrap your head around this, please. In times like these, where people feel so limited, these are the times that people get more creative. They start thinking more. They start um, acting more. They start doing the things that they never were able to do because they weren't in the position to do it. But now with all the limitations, not being able to go outside, you can't be around people. Those are limitations, but now we have to get, um, we have to get smarter about what we're doing. We have to think more about how we're going to do things. And it technically, um, the way I see it, it makes your mind work harder because now the same routine that we used to be in, we're not in anymore. So now we have to change. We have to think more. Um, we have to make these adjustments. So um, today, what I want you to think about, and, and if, you, if it's possible, you know, write this down. Uh, I am recording this, but um, think of it like this. My limitations will be the creation of my success. Let me say it again. My limitations will be the creation of my success. And how is that possible? Well, it's possible because if you're limited in doing one thing, you're gonna get creative and you're gonna think about how to make something else work, which means that the position you're in might be the best position for you because now you have to force yourself to maybe make calls that you wouldn't have made, talk to people that you wouldn't have talked to, utilize technology um, in a way that you never would have used before because you were never limited. But with this limitation, it can create things that you never would have created before if this limitation hadn't been in front of you right now. And now think of it like this, with everyone changing how they're doing things. Think of it like this, if every individual contributed to something, think of the impact that we all could have in some positive way. So every individual can take actions to contribute so collectively we have a positive impact. So your limitations will cause you to make a change in what you do. Someone else's limitations will cause them to make a change in what they're doing and with those, imagine the positive impact we could collectively have to what we're doing to our jobs, to our families, um, to the world in some cases. And it's times like these when major companies are created. It's times like these when entrepreneurs come out of the woodwork because the limitations they have. Um, some people are being laid off. Some people are being furloughed. Um, people are, you have to stay home, like by law. So 
These are the times that I want you guys to be encouraged to change how you're doing things, how you're thinking because of the limitations. Don't look at that. Look at what you do have. If I'm limited in one area, then how can I take action to be um, more active in another area? These are the times, and, and the encouragement is simple. Your limitations can be, and they will be, the creation of your success if you allow it. And what I mean by that is stop looking at just the limitation. Look at the possibilities. Look at what you're going through and what you can create from these limitations. So I appreciate you guys getting on this call. Every individual, if every individual takes a positive step or takes a positive action in some direction, then collectively we can have a positive impact on our lives, on the people around us and the world as a whole, because this is what we need right now. We all have to take a limitation, get a better position. Once we get the better position, it may push us into our purpose. What if this limitation actually put you in a position to help you pursue your purpose? That's what I want you guys to really think about. What is it that I do have that I can do? Who can I help? Who can I positively affect? What call can I make? Who can I send a positive text message to? So this can actually help someone else. So I encourage you guys to go out and not just look at your limitation as something you can't do. I want you to look at the limitations as take you into another step or another area of your life on what you can do and what you can create. Again, you guys, um, we're going to keep doing this. We're going to keep sending those positive uh, vibes out, send that positive energy out to as many people as we possibly can. Thank you so much for being on the call. Hopefully this helped. Hopefully you got something out of it. We'll talk to you again. Ken Jackson, the KJFX. You guys have a very blessed day and take every limitation as a blessing because it could push you into your purpose. Take care. We'll talk to you later.